Sorry, what? Uh, uh, I'll just take some more of that cheese. Cody doesn't respect anything. Not even my naps before <coughs> meals. A truck? Could it be the ice cream man? Oh no, it's the animal annihilation facility. No, they're taking Arlene. I just saw her in the back of the truck. We have to do something. Odie, hurry up. You gotta save her. Because I'm a bit tired right now. Okay, I'm coming. <sighs> what would you all do without me? We'll go through the gardens to catch up with them. I found a key. I'll just warn you, I refuse to carry more than one key at a time. It would be too much for a poor little kitty like me. There's no chance we can catch up with him if we take the road. It would also make me tired. Going through the gardens would be good. I can jump, if I really have to. Don't overdo it. It's exhausting. And don't make me jump too high. We wouldn't want me to get hurt now, would we? Certain doors have to be opened with a switch instead of a key. You have to hold the switch down for the door to stay open. Who knew Odie would end up being useful? Odie, heal! Ouch! That flea bag got me! I'm warning you, if this kind of thing happens to me again, I'll... I'll... give up! When provoked, I will fight back. Especially when my food is on the line. I can pick up these ingredients and make myself a really good meal. Mmm. These could make a delicious lasagna.
Hody, I think I'll need your help again to get that crate down. Refuse to swim. It's just too exhausting. What's more, I've just pampered myself with a special silky coat shampoo. So if I fall into the water, you can count me out. Ah. Some switches don't open doors, but they can activate things or make objects move. This is way too hard. All this thinking is making me hungry.
You're gonna fall. You fell. If falling into holes would be considered a sport, Odie would be a world champion. Odie! 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 This game wouldn't be called Garfield rescuing a dumb, stupid, slobbering dog by any chance, would it? There's obviously nothing interesting to be found here. If Odie were a bloodhound of any sort, we'd know by now. It's impossible to go up this way. Well, where is the exit? I hope there's a lift somewhere. They really don't expect me to walk up the stairs, do they? Snapping, television snacking before, after, and during meals kind of cat. But Odie loves them. I can throw this bone. If Odie sees it, he'll go get it. Swimming is exhausting, and more suitable for dogs. If I throw a bone to the other side, Odie will get in the water to fetch it, and I can ride over on his back. I like to watch others work. It relaxes me. If Odie can't see the bone I've thrown, he won't fetch it, and he'll just sit around looking stupid, as usual.
Ah! 
Okay, let's go across town. We'll go through the gardens. It'll be faster.
looks like this dog is a little tougher than the others. I don't think I can beat him. It's not like I'm scared or anything, but I've just remembered that I got one of my claws stuck in a pasta noodle yesterday, and it hasn't finished healing yet. Recipe for cheesecake. One of my favorites.
Uri, no! Uri, what happened? Speak, boy. Uri, this time you are stuck. I need to find a way to get into this factory. I wonder if I can get through the roof.
Woody doesn't seem to be here. Well, we'll just have to do without him for the moment. But where am I? This factory makes alarm clocks. The only thing I hate more than mornings is an alarm clock. With these new ingredients, I can make a vanilla milkshake, the ideal drink for professional sprinters.
Okay, this was the game's unique emotional sequence. Now it's over and done with. Let's move on to other things. I lied to you, you flea bag. The script forced me to say that. Thank you. 
I've just gone through the equivalent of a full year of Monday mornings. How awful. We should see the truck that has Arlene drive past it any moment now. Didn't I tell you? There it is. It's always the same for each sequence. Come on, Odie. Let's follow him.
beans, meat, spices. All I need to make a good chili con carne. So I may have overdone it a little on the spices.
Oh, okay. This place is not good. You know, I just remembered. I left the bolognese sauce simmering on the stove at home. We should really get back. Arlene will be okay without us, won't she? Okay, Odie, I'll follow you. But don't rush me. I haven't taken my nap. And when I haven't taken my nap... Okay, okay, I'm coming.
This place is getting better and better. A real tourist site. The natives really know how to treat their guests. Come on, let's find Arlene and get out of here. I don't want to miss my dinner. Oops! <laughs> 
Sorry, what? Uh, I'll just take some more of that cheese. Cody doesn't respect anything. Not even my naps before <laughs> meals. A truck? That's strange. I think I've had a dream about this before. I know what'll happen if I go. There'll be danger, huge responsibilities, tiring challenges, and... Oh, my favorite television show is coming on, so I think I'll stay at home while Odie runs after the truck without me. Odie, don't go through the gardens. It'll be much faster taking the road. 
I'm hungry. Maybe John's made some lasagna.